It's been a few days since Bororo and Krong got back from the dinosaur world. They entered through a book, and Bororo dreams every night of the dinosaur friends that they met. Brachio, <laughs> 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 stop it! It tickles! <laughs> Hey, hey! Oh, come on! You're tickling me! Uh, huh? Uh, a dream? It was all just a dream! Krong, why are you sleeping in my bed? It's not Krong! It's a dinosaur! The dinosaur book crang! Does the baby dinosaur come out of the dinosaur book? Crong crong!
awfully weird looking dinosaur. <laughs> What's this little thing that's biting me? Oh, I'm sorry. She lost her mom and dad and she's very, very upset. <laughs> Tell me, have you seen a dinosaur around here that looks like her? I wonder, does this Pong Pong baby dinosaur fart all the time like this? Pong Pong, huh? That sounds cute. <laughs> okay then, from now on we'll call you Pong Pong, okay? <laughs> Pong Pong Krong. <laughs> cute. You're cute. Hmm. I might have seen one that looks like her, but then again, maybe I haven't. Oh. The micro raptor hurriedly climbed the big tree, as if it had just seen something. The micro raptor had sharp claws. And it climbed very fast. <laughs> wow, look at that! It reached the top of the tree already! But what's he doing that for? Hold on, do you think it saw a dinosaur that looks like Pong Pong? Pororo and Kron looked up hopefully at the Micro Raptor, who sat high above them in the treetop. Suddenly, the Micro Raptor stretched its whole body flat and jumped up high with all its might. Ah! Wow! The micro raptor glided from tree to tree with ease. When he saw a lizard, he pounced. And it was a successful hunt. I got it! <laughs> oh, it was just something for you to eat. But then, when you saw that lizard, why didn't you just fly straight to it? Why did you climb to the top of the tree? Do you think I'm some kind of a bird just because I have these wings? What I do is glide through the air from high up places, but I can't fly into the air from the ground. Oh, I think I get it. So you're like a flying squirrel. I read in a book that flying squirrels also spread their bodies out to glide from tree to tree. Wrong. Uh, uh, a flying what? What's that? Well, I think that does sound a little like me. <laughs> well, I can glide slowly down from high places very easily. All thanks to these. These are thick feathers on my front and back legs. The Micro Raptor spread its dark, shiny wings for Bororo and the gang to see. My feathers. This dinosaur was looking for an egg it lost. You did? Who was it? And where? Krang, krang. If you go this way along this road, it'll lead to a river at the edge of the forest. I think it was near there. Oh, wow. Thank you. Go, Pong. Pong, Pong, come on. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Goodbye, then. I hope you find Pong Pong's mom and dad very, very soon. Goodbye. Krang. The Micro Raptor waved and said goodbye to Pororo, Krong, and Baby Pong Pong. Then the three of them walked toward the edge of the forest, hoping to find the dinosaur. Just then, they heard the thump, thump, the thumping sound of the footsteps. Oh, goodness. Babies, why are you all out here? It's dangerous to be out and about. Let's get back to our nest quickly. <laughs> A huge dinosaur suddenly appeared. Could this dinosaur be Pong Pong's mother? 
Dango Mororo. See you all in the next episode. The mommy dinosaur took Pororo, Krong, and Pong Pong by her mouth and gently walked back to her nest. Ah, she's trying to move us back to the nest. <sighs> I thought she was going to eat us. <sighs> when the mommy dinosaur finally reached her nest, she carefully placed the three friends down. Now, did anyone get hurt? My clothes are just a bit wet, but that's okay. Crown, crown. That's a relief. Mama's going to get some berries and grass for you. So play nice and no fighting, okay? Mama? Oh, one second. I have a question. What's your question? Yeah, you can ask us. Uh, uh? Pororo and Krong had just started to look around the nest when they were met. <laughs> With a big surprise, the nest was already full of baby dinosaurs. But when were you born? I have so many younger siblings, I can't even remember. Uh, we're not siblings. You see, we're looking for Pong Pong's mother and father. Do you think she could be your little sister? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think her mouth looks a little different from ours. That's right. Her mouth isn't long like ours. Mm -hmm. Pong Pong, are you hungry? This is fresh grass that Mama chewed up for us to eat. Have some. I guess Pong Pong doesn't like grass at all. <laughs> what is this smell? Oh, this is a sausage. Uh, it's made of meat. What? You, you, you eat meat? Are, are you car? Are you carnivorous dinosaurs? We are herbivorous dinosaurs! Ugh, this is bad. I know Mom's eyesight is bad, but still, how could she bring home carnivorous dinosaurs? Oh! You don't have to be afraid of us! Pong Pong is still very young. She's just a baby, and she doesn't attack other dinosaurs, right, Crank? <laughs> oh, are you, are sure? you sure? Pororo reassured the baby dinosaurs, and then he slowly looked around the nest. What dinosaur has a beak that's as long as a duck's, likes to eat a lot of plants, and is so good it's babies that it even chews up leaves for them? Aha! Mayasaura! Aren't you all Mayasauras? Baby, I love you. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Pat, pat, pat. I love you. Baby, I love you. Rub, rub, rub. Stroke, stroke, stroke. I love you. Mayasaurus footsteps 
getting louder. Hello, kids. You must be hungry. Mama brought back lots of tasty grass for all of you. I'll have it chewed up for you in no time. Yay! <laughs> Mama, you're the best! <laughs> Pororo, Hong Kong, and Croc left the nest quietly while the Mama Mayasora fed her babies. It wasn't the easiest thing to look at. But isn't it so cool how the Mama Mayasora chews up plant leaves just to feed her babies? <laughs> oh, dear. Where are you all going? Oh, she saw us! Run! <laughs> Just then, Bong Bong became nervous and began to fart. No, stop! Oh. Goodness, where did you run off to so fast? My dears! <sighs> I thought she was going to take us back to the nest. I think my hand smells like farts now. Uh, it really does smell like farts. Oh. Uh, yeah. Who are you? Grung, grung. Me? I'm a little brave baby ankylo. Oh, oh, oh no, the volcano's shaking as if it's going to erupt at any moment. The whole place is shaking and even the rocks are crumbling. This awesome dinosaur that saved Pororo, Krong, and the other baby dinosaurs. Dino Pororo! See you all in the next episode! been shaking the ground fiercely, finally simmered down. You can come out now. <sighs> Are you sure you didn't get hurt? Yes. Are you okay, Daddy? I saw you got hit by a huge rock. Your daddy's fine. My back is as tough as armor, so there was nothing to worry about. Uh, are you fellas okay? Yes! <laughs> Thank you for saving us! <laughs> Don't mention it. <laughs> Pororo, Krong, and Pong Pong stared at the awesome dinosaur daddy, who might as well have been a superhero. Wow! A body covered in a tough armor-like hide! With big rocky club at the tip of its tail! <laughs> Aha! This dinosaur is an Ankylosaurus! I think I have. But I think she looks like the baby of a strong carnivorous dinosaur. A strong carnivorous? 
dangerous dinosaur. <laughs> but still, I bet my daddy's stronger than Pong Pong's daddy. My daddy can even beat a daddy Tyrannosaurus any day. Wow, really? Grung, grung? Please, how could daddy beat a Tyrannosaurus? Why not? You have this big club tail that can help you. If you were to hit a Tyrannosaurus hard in the face, all its super scary teeth would just fall out. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> Who can beat me? Tyrannosaurus? <laughs> you said something about making my teeth fall out? Uh, my, my baby was only kidding. Uh, please, forgive us. Oh boy, I thought Zimprud had walked in on its own. But this is an Ankylosaurus. And it's a big one at that. Even with my teeth, it will be hard to get through his armor. Then, there's that club tail of his. All it takes is one swing from that rocky club of a tail to break my bones. But then, I'm really so hungry. Plus, if I back down now, they won't take me seriously anymore. I'm just going to have to eat you all! Hey kids, Daddy will distract the Tyrannosaurus, so you run and hide behind the rocks. <laughs> Daddy! Your name is Pororo, right? Look after my kid for me. Okay, don't worry! Over here, Tyrannosaurus! <laughs> Stop right there! <laughs> Come on, let's hide now! <laughs> You said your dad can knock out all of the Tyrannosaurus's teeth with one swing of its tail. <laughs> it's all my fault. <laughs> if only I didn't say that. <laughs> It'll be okay. Your dad's really brave. <laughs> but he's alone out there, and he is up against a very scary Tyrannosaurus. And what if my daddy's tail attack doesn't work? Just then, the daddy Ankylosaurus saw his chance and swung his mighty tail at the Tyrannosaurus's hind leg. Yeah! He almost broke my leg. <sighs> I guess it's my turn now. <laughs> oh, I am grilled. Oh gosh, no! <laughs> Hang on. From behind, doesn't the Tyrannosaurus look like Pong Pong a little bit? Grung? You? Pong Pong, it's your dad. <laughs> That's the Tyrannosaurus! Crown? Crown, crown! Mr. Tyrannosaurus! Do you remember us? Crown! Crown, crown! <laughs> I think it's time to put an end to this hunt! about my Tina. Uh, it's... It's you two! The Tyrannosaurus finally recognized Pororo and Krong and stomped over to them with glee. <laughs> hey, it's you guys again, huh? Pororo and Krong! <laughs> Mr. Tyrannosaurus! <laughs> Krong, Krong! Uh, who are you? What? Daddy? Pong Pong jumped right into the Tyrannosaurus's arms. Could this Tyrannosaurus really be Pong Pong's father? 
Daino Pororo. See you all in the next episode. Yet. What are you talking about? Ah, uh, your eggs? You mean she accepted your proposal? Grump, <laughs> And it's all thanks to you two. Hmm? What's going on here? Do you know each other? Oh, you bet we do. Thanks to these two, my sweetheart Tina accepted my proposal. What? The Tyrannosaurus explained what happened to him after meeting Pororo and Krom. He even said he bought her flowers, just like Pororo had suggested, and that it worked really well because Tina fell in love with him. He happily told everyone the whole story. Wow! Congratulations, Mr. Tyrannosaurus! <laughs> I owe it all to you guys. If it wasn't for you, my dear Tina probably wouldn't have even looked at me. Thanks, guys. Well, if you're grateful for all our help, then maybe you can stop fighting with Mr. Ankylosaurus? What do you think? Okay. What would I not do for you guys? To be honest, he's a tough one to hunt, even for me. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll get going then. Let's go, son. Okay, Daddy. Bye, Pororo. Krong and Pong Pong. Goodbye. Krong, Krong. Hmm. For a herbivore, he seems like a great dad. I'm going to be an awesome dad too, just like him. Mr. Tyrannosaurus, I know you're going to be a great dad. Krong, Krong. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Now tell me, what are you two doing back here? Oh, we're looking for Pong Pong's mom and dad because... Oh? Where is Pong Pong, Krong? Pong Pong! Pong Pong! Is that her over there? Pong Pong? Are you upset, Pong Pong? It's okay. We'll find your mommy and daddy no matter what. Hmm. You know what? I've hunted lots of dinosaurs. I mean, I've met a lot of dinosaurs, and I really haven't seen or met one like Pong Pong around here. Maybe it's because she's so young. Does Pong Pong have anything special about her? Something special? Oh, she farts a lot. Oh no, not like that. Hmm, something special. Something special like... Oh, her head is really hard. Her head? Krang? That looks like it hurt. Krang? Hmm. I know of one dinosaur with a hard head that likes to headbutt. Uh, you do? Krong, krong. It's those dinosaurs over there. I'll only scare them if they see me. So I'll be leaving now. Thank you very much, Mr. Tyrannosaurus. Krong, krong, krong. No problem. Take care. And Pong Pong, I hope you get to find your dad. Oh! Ah, the top of its head is round and smooth like a ball. They look really hard. 
Then around it, they have small spiky horns that go all along the sides. Ah! I think I saw the Steinosaur in the book! It's called... <laughs> a Pachycephalosaurus! The Pachycephalosaurus has a hard round head. Its big skull makes it a good head butter. Oh, oh, the Pachycephalosaurus is the head butting king. It also had butts to fight for a female. Oh, oh, me! Yeah! I'm telling you, Bassoon is mine! No way! She said that she likes me better than you! What? Let's fight! Rawr! That's my line! Are you okay? Why couldn't you just talk it out instead of fighting? Crank, crank. <laughs> it's normal for Pachycephalosauruses to headbutt and fight each other for the females we love. What? So you don't headbutt those scary carnivorous dinosaurs? Ah, using your hard heads? Our heads aren't really hard enough to fight off scary carnivorous dinosaurs. Running away is the best thing to do if you run into one. There's not enough time to even think about headbutting anyone. Yes, that's right. Uh, uh, then why were you fighting with your heads just now if they're not even that hard? Well, that's because... That's because I need to pick the stronger Pachycephalosaurus. Pasoon! <laughs> you see, I'm going to pick the stronger of the two to be my husband. That way my babies will also grow up to be strong Pachycephalosauruses as well. That's why we have to find out who's the strongest and toughest. So Basoon can see who she should choose. Let's fight again. Sure. Yeah. <sighs> it doesn't look like the fight for love will end anytime soon. But anyway, Pong Pong isn't like a Pachycephalosaurus, am I right? If you look at her closely, she doesn't have a hard round thing on her head at all. She also doesn't have those small spiky horns around the edges either, right? Pong Pong, does it hurt a lot? <sighs> Pong Pong, your body is precious and very special, so don't bang it on anything, okay? You understand? <laughs> Who is this dinosaur that's as big as a Tyrannosaurus and has sharp claws that are as long as Krong is tall? Dino Bororo! See you all in the next episode! Don't worry, I'm not a scary dinosaur at all. Oh, uh, are you afraid because of my claws? There, I'm not so scary now, am I? Uh, well, we thought you were going to attack us with those claws. Gosh, no. I'm a gentle dinosaur that likes to eat leaves. Really? Oh. This dinosaur is as big as a Tyrannosaurus, with really long, sharp claws on its front feet. This dinosaur is... Aha! A Therizinosaurus! A huge body and long claws. I may look scary, but you don't have to fear me. I'm a gentle... Really? That's right.
night. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I'm sorry. Did I scare you by coming out so suddenly? <laughs> it's okay. We know you're not scary. You don't have to hide your claws anymore. I don't? <laughs> then please excuse me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is good. You know, these leaves sure hit the spot. <laughs> wow. Do you really use those scary claws just to grab the branches? What do you mean, just? What's more important than eating? Uh, uh, no, I mean, when you're up against scary carnivorous dinosaurs, swish, swish, you can slash them around like swords, right? Oh, I see. I do that sometimes when I'm in danger. But my claws aren't very strong. They're just enough to scare some dinosaurs off. Uh, oh, really? <laughs> it's a Tarbosaurus! A Tarbosaurus is coming this way! What? A Tarbosaurus? <laughs> a Tarbosaurus is a scary carnivorous dinosaur. You'll be in danger if you stay here. Hurry, climb up my front legs. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Do you really think you'll be able to outrun a Tarbosaurus at a pace like that? <laughs> oh, no. Hey, these kids will make for a perfect dessert once I'm done eating you for dinner. <laughs> While I fight her off, you guys run away, okay? Uh, uh, but how will you fight her? You said that your claws aren't really that strong. <laughs> <laughs> they aren't strong, but they look awful scary, don't you think? <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> Do you see these long, sharp, scary claws of mine? You'd better run away before you get hurt. Huh. You can wave those claws around all you want. Roar! <laughs> Mama, Mama, I got something. Come and look at it. Mama! What? Is that so, my dear? <laughs> my son finally came back from his first successful hunt. <laughs> uh -oh. It's getting away. I was so sure I caught it. What? Oh, uh, let Mama go and help you. You guys, stay here until I get back. <laughs> My dear! Mm. Ooh, that was close. Uh, to be honest, after watching you eat leaves with your claws, I thought it was kind of silly. I I'm sorry. Grung, grung, grung. <laughs> I know I can be silly sometimes. Uh, don't say that! When you scared the Tarbosaurus off with your long, sharp claws, you looked amazing! <laughs> <laughs> oh, did I really? <laughs> Thank you so much for protecting us, Mr. Therizinosaurus! <laughs> don't mention it. The Tarbosaurus might come back, so you should get out of this forest quickly. Uh oh! That Torbosaurus is already back! <laughs> uh, uh, hold on real tight, kids! <laughs> Stop right there! Mr. Therizinosaurus! Look up ahead of us! I got you! Uh, uh, uh. After being cast into the sea, 
Will Pororo, Krong, and Pong Pong be okay? Dino Pororo! See you all in the next episode! <laughs> Are you guys okay? Oh, that long thing was his neck. This dinosaur has a small head and a long neck, and he's swimming with four strong fins. I think I saw this in the book. Hmm. Aha! I remember now! That lives in the sea I swim well with my fins But my mouth is so small I can't hide big fish <laughs> Wow! My gosh! Mr. Elasmosaurus, you have a really long neck! Oh, you're just like a Brachiosaurus from the sea! <laughs> ah, I heard that rumor! But there are land dinosaurs like us with really long necks, just like ours. They're called Brachiosauruses, right? Yes. yes! Hello, hello! Will you be my friends? Uh, huh? <laughs> this here's my son. He's been making a lot of new friends recently. And now he wants to be friends with everyone he meets. Pong Pong really seems to like you. <laughs> really? <laughs> That's great. And now that we're friends, here's a present for you. Wow! What are those? These are ammonites. Uh, an ammonite? Wow. It's so heavy. It looks just like a snail shell. Oh! There's a hole in it. Oh, yeah! ah! what, what is this? You've never seen an ammonite before? They're like squids that hide their bodies in their shells. There's a whole bunch of them swimming around in the ocean. Son, these guys look like land dinosaurs. But... Do you really have to go back on land? Does that mean we can't be friends? Oh. It's okay. We don't have to live in the same place to be friends. <laughs> Isn't that right, Krong? Krong, Krong. Uh, really? Mm -hmm. Really. And thank you so much for the salmonite that you gifted us. <laughs> don't mention it. It's really tasty in case you didn't know. Uh, I think they're a little too big for us to eat. <laughs> but they really are very delicious. Pong oh? Pong, is it that good? <laughs> See, I told you they tasted good. Pong <laughs> Pong.
along with the baby Elasmosaurus, talked amongst themselves for a long time as they swam across the wide ocean until they could finally see land. <laughs> Here we are. We finally reached land. Thank you so much. Goodbye. <laughs> Yay! You're leaving already? But we just became friends. Huh? You're saying we should give him a present as well? Oh, that's a good idea, Krong. But what can we give him? Krong. A bag? We should give him our bag? This is for me? Should I eat it? Thank you. Wow! It's super delicious! Thank you, Pong Pong. <laughs> Goodbye now. I hope to see you again. Bye! Goodbye! <laughs> Mororo and friends said goodbye to the baby Elasmosaurus before all heading back into a forest. Will they finally be able to find Bong Bong's mom and dad in the forest? Dino Mororo! See you all in the next episode! Krong and Pong Pong walked and walked along the long forest path for quite some time. Uh, I'm really hungry. Oh, yeah, yeah. Krong, Krong! Okay, let's have something to eat. Krong, what, What's going on? We only have one chocolate bar left. This isn't good. We haven't even found Pong Pong's mom and dad yet. Oh, shucks. We're hungry, so let's go ahead and share what's left. Here we go. I'll cut it into three pieces. Uh, eh? oh, the way it's hiding makes it look very suspicious. Hey there! I don't know what kind of dinosaur you are, but can you come out and show yourself? Krong! 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 They... they caught me. <laughs> this dinosaur is the same height as I am. And it has a hard mouth like a bird's beak. And its front legs are covered in feathers just like a bird. Ah! I got it! <laughs> this dinosaur is an oviraptor! You're an oviraptor, aren't you? I'm an oviraptor and I look like a bird. I'm an oviraptor and I eat a mixed diet. I peck at food with my heart beak and my feathers keep my eggs warm. That's right. I'm a Noviraptor, yes. Oh, here. I wanted to give this back to you. I'm sorry. Actually, my wife has some eggs inside her right now. And it's just that she wants something to eat other than the usual lizards we have, that is. Really? I knew it wasn't right, but... But I wanted to feed my wife something new, and... I'm really sorry, guys. We understand. Krunk, krunk. Yeah. <laughs> Honey? Honey? D darling? I I really have to go now. Sorry. Should we follow him? Krunk, krunk. Krunk, krunk. Krunk. Honey! It 
couldn't have been easy, laying all these eggs. <laughs> I'm really fine. I'm sure it couldn't have been easy for you to gather all the food for me either. No, no. I still wasn't able to bring you something new like you asked me to. <clears throat> Yikes! How, how long, how long have you been standing there? Since when you said, ooh, honey? That's how long we've been here, I think. <laughs> Crawl! Is that for me to eat? But you seem to be very hungry yourselves. How about we share it? Crawl? <laughs> Hand it over. I'll cut it exactly into four equal pieces. This is delicious. <laughs> Thank you so much. I was tired after laying my eggs, but thanks to all of you, I feel better now. Thank you so much, guys. Please don't mention it. <laughs> now, I'll keep all these eggs warm. Why don't you lie down and rest, honey? Oh, <laughs> thank you, sweetie. Did you say you're going to keep the eggs warm, mister? <laughs> That's right. Male oviraptors usually incubate all of the eggs their wives lay. We keep them warm by covering them with our feathered front legs and keeping them cozy like this. That way, we can keep all of our babies inside of the eggs nice and warm. <laughs> I think you're going to be a great dad. You, you really think so? <laughs> That's always been a dream of mine, to be a good dad. <laughs> Goodness, Pong Pong. Your farts are really stinky. <laughs> crunk, crunk. <laughs> That wasn't her fart. I'm pretty sure it came from that creature we call Boop Boop. A Boop Boop? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's a fierce meat-eating dinosaur, and it farts whenever it shows up. That lets us know to hide or run away from it before it gets close. So the farts are actually a good thing. And that's also why we call it a Boop Boop. <laughs> <gasps> Honey. We don't have any time to waste. We must hide all of our eggs. Oh, yes, you're right. Kids, you guys should hide as well. Oh, hold on. She's Pong Pong, and her farts smell terrible. And this new dinosaur is called Boop Boop. C could that dinosaur be her? A meat-eating dinosaur called Boop Boop? Could it be the same kind of dinosaur as Pong Pong? Dino Pororo! See you all in the next episode! Two horns on.
on its head. Is it... a Carnotaurus? I'm a meat-eating carnivore. A Carnotaurus. The two horns on my head. They're like an ox's. <laughs> A Carnotaurus The two horns on my head They're like an ox's <laughs> <sighs> Why do I keep farting all the time? <sighs> Yuck! That's stinky! <laughs> uh, oops, sorry. My farts can get really smelly. <laughs> Doesn't look like a very scary dinosaur, does he, Crunk? Crunk, Crunk. Mister, you're what they call a Carnotaurus, aren't you? I sure am. It means an ox that eats meat. Though I always seem to fail at catching any. Why? Why do you always fail? Boop, boop, crunk? Yes. All of a sudden, I started to fart non-stop. Then my stomach started to hurt, and now I can't even poop very well. What is wrong with me? Hmm. Now that I think of it, Pong Pong doesn't poop much either. Pong Pong? Oh, here. <laughs> It's okay, Pong Pong. You can come out now. You? Hey, if my lost egg had hatched, my baby would probably be just that size. You? <laughs> Her fights are just like mine. Aha! I remember one time Krong used to have the same problem as you. He was constipated. Your stomach hurts, but you can't poop. And your tummy is full of gas, so all you can do is toot toot stinky farts. That's right! That's exactly how I am now! S so? What happened? Is your constipation better now? Krang Krang! Of course he's better! Krang makes sure to eat these two things that helps with constipation. And wh what are they? They are water and vegetables. What? Vegetables? You expect a carnivore like me to eat that? I don't eat plants. Oh my, you're right. I forgot you were a carnivorous dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, I will try to drink more water. But will that be enough? Exercise! Exercise, Krung! Aha! How about doing the fart exercises? If you move around a lot, your insides also move around. And that lets out the extra gas. And maybe even some poop. Pong Pong, you try it too. You? Really? I better give that a shot. <laughs> but that exercise, how do you do it? <laughs> I've never done it before. <laughs> Just follow us. Krung, are you ready? Krung, krung. I keep farting. My tummy hurts when I really, really can't poop. Uh, 
I'm sorry. All that exercise is helping me get the gas out of my tummy. What a relief! <laughs> Why? What huh? is it? Uh, at last! I think I might be able to poop! <laughs> You too? Uh, come with me. Let's go poop together. Actually, I lost an egg a few days ago. What? An egg? Really? Where? Well, you see, I came back from a hunt, and when I checked the nest, an egg was missing. But, but still, you have horns on your head, while Pong Pong doesn't have any. Well, we don't get them when we're babies. They grow as we get older. Really? Then could you be... Pong Pong's dad? Uh, you, yes, I believe I'm your dad. <laughs> That's great, isn't it, Krong? <laughs> wow, I'm so glad you found your dad, Pong Pong. <laughs> Now, don't go off wandering all on your own again. Don't worry. I won't lose my baby again. I will keep her close. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, Pororo and Kron's second trip to the dinosaur world ended happily. Trip Krong? <laughs> Krong Krong. <sighs> I'm sleepy. Let's go to bed now. <sighs> Krong. 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 and Krong's trip ended. But your trip might just be the beginning. Don't you want to visit the dinosaur world? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>